Fry apologized today for stealing three quarters of a million dollars from the union members she represented. Despite those words, she'll spend 51 months in a federal prison for embezzlement. Nine News reporter Tom McKee was in federal court as Fry was sentenced, and he's here now with reaction. Tom? Well, Clyde prosecutors said Fry was drunk with power as head of code. Cincinnati organized and dedicated employees and stole because she could. Her attorney asked the court to consider the tireless union work that Fry did and said her life as she knows it is over. However, Judge Susan DeLotte wasn't buying it, saying Fry did with a pen what a drug dealer might do with a gun. Flanked by attorney Blake Summers, Fry arrived hoping for a prison term of two years, but Judge DeLotte said it in more than four years. The judge said most white-collar crimes start small, then grow more and more, but Fry showed blatant disregard for the union from the start. Prosecutors allege the $750,000 Fry stole was for her own personal use on a lavish lifestyle. Now, after the sentencing was over, code union leaders and lawyers reacted to her apology. I just feel, like I said in my statement, she had done that to try and reduce her sentence. Uh, I don't think she feels re any regret or remorse for what she had done. This was a calculated effort. This was a crime. Uh, not inadvertence, not uh, uh, slowly started and got worse. This is a, a plan of action that she followed through. Fry was released on her own recognizance and left U.S. District Court downtown with her husband. She's due to have reconstructive knee surgery next week. However, she has to report on August 7th to begin her prison sentence, likely at the Elderson Federal Penitentiary in West Virginia. Now there's the matter of restitution. Fry has already paid $17,000 back of the money she stole, but still has $741,000 to go. Questions remain whether it will ever be fully recovered. Code Secretary Shadrain Johnson wondered whether Fry took more than anyone knows and is still hiding it. Fry, she said, is committing the crime all over again by continuing to hide things.